Hi everyone, in this video we are going to take a quick first look at this AT Tiny 85 USB mini board. I wanted to take a look at this small board for a long time. It is very small size. It is low cost and it uses a different chip than the Arduino boards. It uses the AT Tiny 85, it has 8 kilobyte of flash memory, 512 bytes of RAM and 6 input output pins. We can program it using the Arduino ID, which make things so much easier. Let's start using this small board. The Digispark uses the Arduino ID165, if using Arduino 166 or higher and Windows you will need to download and install the drivers manually. After download the driver, unzip folder, and run install drivers for 32-bit systems, or deinst64 for 64-bit systems. After open the Arduino ID and go to the file menu, and select preferences. In box labeled additional boards manager link center following patch. If you already have additional link centered in that box, then click the button on the right of the box and enter this link on a new line. Then press OK. After that go to tool menu and then the board sub menu. Select boards manager and then from the type drop down select contributed. Select the Digis Tump AVR boards package and click the install button. You will see the progress on the bottom bar of the window. When complete it will show installed next to that item on the list. With the installation completed, close the window, and select the Digispark from the tool, Boards menu. Digispark default 16 to 5 is the board that should be selected by all new users. We are just getting started and let's continue with a simple code example. Go to File, Examples, Digispark and open Start Sketch. Here is the code it will load. This code will blink the built-in LED. As soon as it has uploaded you should see the LED start to blink. My experience with this board, it is a nice small but it has limited capabilities. It is useful for small projects. In the coming days I will share some projects with this board. If you like this video you can press the like and subscribe to the channel for support.